If you guys are looking for the absolute cheapest coins on the internet right now, head on over to my sponsor, AO. EAH.com. They got the cheapest coins on the market. You can get a million for under 50 bucks. Save that money. Make sure to always use code Poodle at checkout to get your additional 3% off. What's going on, everybody? It's Poodle back with another Madden Ultimate Team video, guys. And today, I'm going to go over the brand new Thanksgiving promo, guys. You know, Autumn Blast, the usual names. But Thanksgiving promo is kind of like the generic name for me in terms of what I like to usually refer to it as. Now, first, you guys see on the screen, we got a new currency has been added to Mutt Blitz Bits. So, pretty much, they are teasing. The blitz promo already which we all knew was coming but this does pretty much mean a few things from what i'm seeing there is a daily solo that does include bl uh, blitz bits so i'm pretty sure that means you could start building and grinding up blitz bits daily to have a decent amount to start the blitz with which will help a lot of no money spend teams of people who just don't really partake in the blitz promo because i mean it is expensive it's understandable now before we get into the video if you're new to the channel hit that subscribe button turn that notification bell give this video a big thumbs up as always and of course guys if you want to check out underdog fantasy and Get involved in some player lineups and some daily fantasy entries. Make sure to use my code and link down below to get up to a free $100 in your first deposit, which is a pretty awesome deal. If you guys have any questions regarding that, hit me up on Twitter or DM me down below in the comment section. Either one will work. Now, let's get into this promo. So, the Blitz bit, Bits have been added. That is a tongue twister. Blitz Bits. If you say it quick enough. Top of the screen right there, you see right next to training with a little arrow looking thing. That's pretty cool. So, let's see. We got the Harvest. Harvest promo. Harvest players and sets. Harvest events. Let's so start with the solos. I always like to start with the good solo sequence and get an idea of what we're working with. So let's scroll all the way up to, okay, we got three. We got Turkey Bull Shenanigans. This is probably going to be the main one if I had to guess. So this is going to be tier one, tier, all the way up to tier 12. Okay, so let's see what we're, we're rocking with here. 80 plus overall Harvest Player is good. 92 overall Turkey Bull Leader. That's really good. 92 overall NCAT Harvest Hero Fantasy Pack. That's really good. And 280 plus Harvest Player. So we got two free 92s of, overall there. And... The thing is, though, guys, I'm pretty sure star-wise, you can only get 150 currently. So, currently, you can go ahead and get the free 92, but you cannot get the tier 8 one yet. There's going to be more as, you know, there's going to be, there's gonna be this release one, right? Family festivities. As we check this out, we get harvest collectibles. So, you can get up to 8 harvest collectibles total. And you got to go ahead and play these to get just harvest collectibles. And then we have daily fixings. Come on in for a daily serving of some hometown favorites. Now, I do want to check something here. Is this going to be... This isn't riddle-based, right? Yeah, because we've had riddles in the past, which are usually super cool. Uh, we have daily fixings. So, green behind the ears. Let's see what we're rocking with here. So, rush to the table before the food gets cold. Play, okay, so very generic. Play objective-based stuff. And if you do this, you get an 80-plus overall harvest player. And you can get all the way up to... Eight, so, all 80 overall pluses plus blitz bits. Now, if, if history serves correctly, my memory at least, 1,200 blitz bits is not going to be that much. Could I be wrong? Very possible, but make sure you guys are getting these done. So daily, you have one, so you can get a total of 10 stars daily. So, <coughs> excuse me, tier three, tier four, five, six, seven. It'll take you approximately, okay, so pretty much each one's a day, give or take. So it'll take you 13 days if you play them every single day to get the max. So I'd recommend you really get on that. You miss even a few and you could easily fall back a few days, right? Uh, you could fall back a decent amount. Now, Let's see, so we have Turkey Bowl, Shenanigans, Family Festivities, Daily Fixins. So that's going to be the solos. So we already have some free 92s there off the rip. And let's go check out um, Let's go check out the house rules. I believe we do have a house rule sitting there as well, which is how you are going to go ahead and get the other Turkey Bowl player, because right? you get one through the solos, and I'm pretty sure you can get the other one through here. Make sure you do not pick the same one. That seems like something someone can do pretty easily. So switch it up. You have backyard games, 25-yard first downs, no special teams. You pretty much have to just go ahead and play this. You guys pretty much know the deal already with, uh, with house rules. Pretty self-explanatory. This one seems easier than usual. Now, NCAT 92 overall Turkey Bowl leader or an 86 overall plus player that's auctionable. I would go with the Turkey Bowl player unless you really can't start on your team. But it's always some decent depth and a few other things there as well. So make sure you are checking that out. I do want to head over to the missions tab to see what we have for ultimate season. Because you do know we'll have something here. So we're going to have... Where is it? Okay, so I do not see... We are in the fourth quarter. That's that's positive. But uh, I do not see an ultimate season tab usually for usually see one for like the harvest promo or something there. Harvest events. If we click on it to here. So here we go. Harvest challenges. If you go into here and you do all these, you will be able to earn. So this is going to be from Turkey Bowl Shenanigans. Okay, so this is just telling you how to get them. That's not actually anything specific there. This is going to be the backyard game house rules. So you are going to get the first harvest voucher at 15 wins. And then you're going to get your 92 overall player at 25 wins. And just some more harvest vouchers and some more stuff towards the end. An 86 overall player at the end. So if you play all of them, that's not horrible, but it's, it's not exactly the best. Harvest objectives. Go through here and 150 stars in harvest. This is going to be like your objective list that I was looking for in open season. So you're going to be able to get some good stuff here. Some harvest vouchers as well as some coins. 
So make sure you play through those. Again, the harvest vouchers, we have to see what they all go for. I'll go over to sets and check it all out. But so far, so good. Looking like a pretty good promo. It looks pretty expensive. I do like when things are like big like that with a lot of things to be doing. Remember, we have the game day all-stars, guys. These are the guys that are going to be performing on Thanksgiving Day that you want to be able to pick and choose who you think is going to do really well. Harvest voucher exchange set. Let's go check that out. Uh, you can get a harvest. Okay, so you can get players with them. Good to know. Let's go check out the sets. That's where that's all going to be. And then after that, we'll finish up by going and check out the actual players on the auction block. So let's go over to sets here. Now, this is exciting. The harvest voucher is going to be a lot of free stuff, it seems like, if I'm not mistaken here. So let's go to the voucher exchange. So 12 Harvest Vouchers get you a free 92 overall hero, which a fantasy pack, which is actually really good because if you think about it, you get a lot of Harvest Vouchers from playing. So you're going to at least get another free 92 here. Um, free pack. You can get an, you can get an NCAT fantasy pack for three. So 12 for an auctionable, NCAT for three. In my opinion, you can only repeat it once, right? Does that mean you can only do it once or does that mean you can do it once? Okay, probably just once. So you can only do it once. So in my opinion, you want to take the NCAT one for sure. And cap for sure. Then I'm probably going straight for the 92 overall after that. So that's another. That's like two free 92s right there alone, easily. So that's another two. You already have like another four going on. Game day all stars. All right, so this ain't gonna be getting these guys. So you have to exchange harvest players. So 90 overall, 88 overall. So I'm not sure how much they're gonna cost, but I know it's, it'll be decent. 98k. These should drop a little bit. Um, these are gonna cost. These cards will probably cost you a decent amount, especially. I mean, they're gonna come down. You could probably buy them straight off the auction block unless they're direct collectibles this year. Oh, no, it's that. Okay, so you can't actually do anything with it. So you, until they probably increase, once they increase, if I'm not mistaken, once they increase their overall, they will be auctionable. So don't like freak out about that. But they might cost a decent amount to do. Now, I will make, if you guys want to see, I'll make a separate video today going over the best ones to take from these to actually go ahead and do for all you guys wondering which ones are the best ones to bet on. And then we have the champions. We have Deion Sanders, Chase Young, and Antonio Brown. Those are some really big names. Let's go check out those stats. That's some exciting stuff to see right there. So, so far, guys, this promo's a big W. I really do like this promo. Better than most promos, and quite honestly, they've done pretty good with promos this year. Let's go check this out, though. We have some stuff to check. Auction House. Okay, so let's start with the 94 overalls here, obviously, because there's some pretty big names that I do want to get checking out on this. Now, I know this filter's not going to be great, so I got to go filter out by some stuff here. So make sure we're looking at what we want to see. Now, there's going to probably be a few filters for this, right? Or is it going to be all under, har all under Harvest? Okay, I like that because there's been like Harvest All-Stars, Harvest stuff. All right. Start with Antonio Brown. Let's go to the highest price so it doesn't get bought out on us, hopefully. 94 overall route runner. 92 speed. 90 jump. I wish that speed was just a notch higher. 93 catching. 91 catching traffic. 93 spec. 90 short running. 92 medium. And 92 deep route running. If that speed was one higher, this car would be really, really good. It's only 92. Um, still going to be good, though, because he's a route runner archetype. <clears throat> so route tech and stuff, super cheap. Behind the card, 91 change of direction, 92 juke, you're going to get 90 spin, going to get 88 break tackle, this card's good, this card's a good card, I don't think it's like the best wide receiver in the game, but it's good, it's good for sure, he is tiny, he is not, um, he's not the fastest, I uh, wish that was a little bit higher, but he's good, let's check out Deion Sanders, finally a Deion Sanders card, we've been waiting forever for this card, 90, 93 speed, okay, wish that again was one speed higher, but 94 speed, 95 excel powered up, he will get 95 man, 95 play rec, 95 zone. So complete lockdown corner with only 82 press. At always 82 press. It's like it's like they have that written down already. 89 catching powered up. That's just insane. Going to be a goon defensively and with the ball in his hands. 80 carry. He gets 94 change of direction. 96 ball carry vision. He gets 99 juke already. 93 spin move. He's in an 82 medium round running. 99 break tackle. Guys, this guy's going to be an insane kick returner. Mind you. Insane kick returner. Make sure he's your kick returner. As well as going to be one of the most one of the best guys locked down as well as one of the best once he gets a pick like it's hard to really tackle him like he's gonna have the open field of looseness to really just get past people he's good Deion sanders is a meta card very very assumed that that would have been the case right we, like, we knew that jabril peppers my giant safety here let's see if they did him some love here 92 speed okay 94 excel 90 tackle 91 play rec 95 pursuit 93 man 90 zone 94 hit power so powered up and everything, he's going to have 95 hit power with 91 zone, with 94 man, with 96 pursuit, with 92 play work, with 93 speed. This card is a goo. 95 excel, 82 catching, 89 change of direction, only 81 juke, but this card, this card's good. 70 block shed, this card's a goon. Jabril Peppers is one of the top safeties in the game. I don't think he's maybe the best one, or he's definitely at least close to it, right? 95 overall, 96. That's, that's a good safety. That's If he had one more speed, even better. But yeah, that's a good safety regardless. That's a damn good safety. Now, where's Mr. Young? He's the only one we're missing here, right? Where's Chase? Either people aren't making this set, or somehow this is filtered wrong. Is he like a 93? No, he's a 94 for sure. We'll move on down, though, for the time being. Chase Young looked really good yesterday from the pre-reveal. I saw of him as well. But 
These are some of the lower ones, guys. I mean, again, you know, they are what they are. I mean, Frank Ragnow is going to be a good option as a free one, obviously. He's a center, pass protector. Just set it and forget it. Lock it up. Going to be all threshold besides run block finesse. Going to be a great center. I mean, if you're going to take... I'll rank... I'm going to do two videos probably. Probably going to rank the free ones as well as the best all-stars to take. I'll probably be doing that today, so stay tuned for those two videos. So I'll get back to all these 92s. I'll be ranking them in a second video, so definitely check out that video. That's when I'll do these more in depth. These take a while to talk about, obviously. I'm not seeing Chase Young up here. But Chase Young was good, though, guys. Another meta card. He's going to be really, really good. He's super athletic. Great finesse. Great block shed. Chase Young, right? Now, guys, better for the video. I covered almost all of what I want to cover here. A lot of free players. I don't know. There's like two from the solos. You can get two from the sets. There's two from the house. There's like six, and I'd have to imagine there's probably one more I'm missing. We got like six plus free 92s here. This is going to be a really good promo. I really like it so far. We got Blitz Bolts, Tees. We have Blitz at the end of the month. Going to be a big month, guys. So make sure to subscribe, turn that notification bell. And if you guys want to check out Underdog Fantasy, head on down below. Use my code Poodle and my link for the exclusive offer. You can only get through my code. And that's about it. Enjoy the rest of your day, guys. If you need coins for this promo, head on down below to my sponsor. But I'm out. Peace.